because my wife and Grace are best friends, we are forced to be best friends too. But, but see ourselves as colleagues. Where we have Smoko at his house and do all the work in my house. <laughs> Long, long ago, a girl was on a school bus minding her own business when a boy sat behind her and began to pester her, pulling her ponytail. You know that classic, if a girl I like, I annoy her. She might like me back, but this didn't seem to work. So Jamie took another tact, writing beautiful love letters. Luckily for him, they seemed to work and a childhood sweetheart romance began. For those of you that don't know me, I'm the original Jamie in Grace's life. <laughs> I'm Grace's very proud little sister and I'm incredibly honoured to be standing up here today. Over the years, Grace and Jamie have become two of my favourite people in this world. They are fire and water and I'm sure you can guess who's who. <laughs> but they are the best combination. Jamie, you drew the short straw and got stuck with JD, always making you do work at our house. Even when we invite you over for a games night, a quick hey bro, come take a look at this, ends up with you holding Jib for the next hour while JD screws it to the wall. <laughs> for anyone that doesn't know, Grace was just 15 when Mr Myers came on the scene. They told a different story about it today, but I'll tell you the real story. <laughs> You see, she'd had a string of five minute boyfriends and Jamie was the last boy left on the school bus. <laughs> Pretty much since that day they have been inseparable. We'd like to welcome Grace to the, to the Myers family and of course the Myers name. And now that you're Myers, um, certain responsibilities come with that name. <laughs> but I'll, I'll let Jamie explain those in due course. In all seriousness, Jamie, I'm honoured to be your best man. Uh, you're one of the most hardest workers I've ever met. I mean, look at all the jobs done at mine. <laughs> you have achieved so much more than the average man, and I'm so proud of you. And I'm so proud to call you my best friend. Hello. You look good. <laughs> If I could make only one change about today, it would be to have Dad here with us. I know he is watching over this moment with a big grin on his face. He will be so proud of you and all you have achieved in life so far. Okay, Rose. <laughs> 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 that should be a fly next barney. <laughs> <laughs> I think I know what's happening. <laughs> what, do you, what do you think is happening? What's your rough idea? <laughs> <laughs> Grace, some people would say that this has been a long time coming. <laughs> you look absolute, absolutely beautiful today and I cannot believe this is the day I get to marry the love of my life. I'm looking forward to what the future brings, whatever that may be, to one day start a family of our own, to travel, to build the life we've dreamt of, and to make more loving memories together. I promise to always be by your side through the good times and the bad. I promise to be faithful, to love and support you for the rest of our lives. And I promise to support you when you try to save five dollars on a piece of road. <laughs> I love you, Grace, now and forever. Just gonna dust it off. <laughs> I had a feeling you were gonna do that. Our relationship started where all good relationships do, 15 years old on the school bus. Ever since the day that I met you back on the bus, I knew there was something about you. 
And no, it wasn't because he had bleached highlights in your hair or because he used to pull my ponytail when I sat in front of you. I promise to always have your back and you'll always have me in your corner. I promise to challenge you to be everything that I know you can be and to always see in yourself what I see. I promise to support and encourage and believe in anything that you do. And I promise to always crack the eggs when you make me breakfast. <laughs> I know that I can be a little indecisive at times, like when I don't know what to eat, but today I stand here making the easiest decision of my life and becoming your wife. I love you always. <laughs>